Here at Fort Benning, you'll see all kinds of wildlife. Deer to armadillos, alligators to hogs, but bears? Nicole Bateman has more. Bears can be found out in the woods and near lakes, but on the highway on Harmony Church? Well, that's just what happened. Little Yogi was spotted and struck right here on this very spot on Harmony Church. And while the Office of Environmental Conservation says there's nothing to be alarmed about, I wanted to arm you with a little bit more information about black bears. There's nothing to be alarmed about. While bears do eat a lot, people are not included in that diet. Primarily, bears in the southeastern U.S. are omnivores, so the vast majority of their diet is, is vegetation and fruits. What? Bears don't eat humans? Bears do not eat humans. So why are there suddenly bears on Fort Benning? This time of year it's pretty typical for young juvenile male bears to get displaced from their original place of birth. Bears aren't looking to cause trouble or terrorize people. They are just like Yogi Bear. Their priority is your picnic basket. Are bears trying to terrorize people on Fort Benning? Absolutely not. If they do end up in their neighborhoods or in close proximity to where they're living or working is because that bear is looking for a free meal. Even so, here are a few rules to follow. Don't feed bears. Don't approach bears. Don't taunt bears. Do this and you can think of yourself as bear proof. Nicole, I never expect to see a bear here at Fort Benning. Is there a place I can go for more information? Yeah, absolutely, Sarah. If you want any more information about black bears or you definitely want to report seeing one, call the Office of Environmental Conservation here on Fort Benning. Thanks, Nicole.